Bahrain 13. We heard from Alistair Burke last year in the, when he was questioned at the parliament about the charges against the Bahrain 13 and whether the charges related to freedom of expression has been dropped or not. His answer was there are other convictions, which we obviously not aware of. In 2014, uh, the FCO has got their report, and Bahrain was a case study within their report where they clearly indicated there is a process of a reform in the judicial system. What is your comment on that? Excellent judgments. I don't know uh, what was reviewed by the people uh, who issued the report you referenced. I suspect that they do not do uh, even a moderately detailed analysis of these documents. <coughs> As to the, the first point, we saw a number of cases in which, in theory, all of the charges relating to speech-related activities were dropped. Um, what typically happened is that charges related, brought under penal code provisions that are facially in violation of international law were dropped. But a charge like terrorism, which doesn't necessarily implicate freedom of speech, would be pursued on the basis of activities that were nothing more than the exercise of free speech or the right to peaceful assembly. So it, the, the analysis has to be a slightly more subtle than just saying certain provisions of the penal code are not being charged in this case anymore. The question is, what are the alleged acts? That's more important than the question of what penal code provisions are being used. What you mentioned, sorry. The, uh, you know, the FCO report, Human Rights Report this year, had kind of a special framing of the Bahrain issue, but not as a country of concern, quote unquote, but as a, just a case study. And it was basically a very positive spin, uh, and, and cited, in fact, the you know, judicial reforms as one of the indications of things going in a positive way. And we said to, uh, in the conversation with the people at the foreign office today, we said, you know, this is just, uh, this just doesn't fit. I mean, it's, 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 this is not reality, you know? And one thing they kept coming back to, well, do you see any improvement at all? You know, kind of anything? If we can't say that, what can we say about how things have improved? And, you know, we, we have to say, you know, no, not really. We don't really see any substantive improvement in, in, the, uh, in the human rights situation in Bahrain.